Art in Public Places is dedicated to celebrating Boynton Beach's heritage and character, creating a cultural environment, and stimulating economic growth and revitalization. Even in this downturned economy and stressful times, art can lift our spirits and inspire our dreams. Art is essential to the health and vitality of our community. Even though the public art program, which is funded by impact fees collected from development and redevelopment projects, has a limited budget, we continue to offer many free programs to the public in very creative and cost-effective ways. Swing Space is a program where original artwork enlivens and enriches our community by exhibiting in vacant storefront windows. This program celebrates regional artists, evokes safety, and motivates visitors to walk the plaza, discovering new businesses along the way. Partnering with the City of Boynton Beach Swing Space program was one of the best marketing decisions we've made since the launch of Quantum Town Center. Avenue of the Arts is a free outdoor on-loan art exhibit in the downtown core, designed to attract visitors and assist the CRA's redevelopment efforts. It has garnered national attention and positive press for the city of Boynton Beach. The Avenue of the Arts is now a frequent stop for the Museum of Lifestyle and Fashion History Tours. Several groups in Western communities often remark on the city amenities, restaurants, and stores that they encounter during their tour. Several new development projects have complied to the city's public art ordinance. They are encouraged to include public art in their development or redevelopment plans and follow the art in public places procurement process. The City Arts Commission reviews the projects and guides the project planners on the public art siting, project relevance, budgetary, maintenance, and safety components. Sunshine Square, a freshly renovated shopping center, commissioned Mark Fuller to create three 12-foot sculptures. Each sculpture, comprised of six aluminum leaf clusters, create vertical columns that greet visitors to the plaza's open center. The public artwork titled, The Anticipated Harvest, pays homage to our tropical Florida paradise. PNC Bank's Green Wall, titled Mangrove Gate, by Matt Rowan and Jonathan Toner, provides a striking and beautiful landmark to Boynton Beach. It echoes and amplifies Florida's extraordinary landscapes and ecosystems. Educational signage, featured on one of the mangrove sculptural elements, explains how this eco-art wall is one of the many sustainable building aspects that PNC has implemented in this LEED certified building. Old Dixie EcoWalk is a first public-private partnership for reforestation of a city easement project. This public eco-art project connects a wildlife habitat to neighboring Seacrest Scrub Park, existing native plantings, and the city's future Blue Ways Greenways project. Dixie EcoWalk's creator, Lucy Keshavars, uniquely combines native plants that attract and sustain butterflies with informational panels that educate the public about the project's energy-saving community. Sculptural rock resting areas, butterfly watering holes, and plant identification plaques actively encourage the public to learn about the benefits of this new wildlife habitat. This collaboration demonstrates to the public the green building features of Seaborn Cove, the nation's first and largest sustainable gated community. Communities that are committed to providing opportunities for experiencing art are considered more livable because they are attractive to businesses and industry, offering a higher quality of life for residents. Art-related tourism generates extra visitors and revenue, attracts high-income consumers, extends the tourist season, and is a green form of the industry. In this way, art-related tourism is believed to contribute to the regeneration of cities. So breeze into Boynton Beach, where art in public places contributes to our vibrant community. To learn more about the Art in Public Places program, we welcome you to visit www.boyntonbeacharts.org.